As far as Shaker, tactically, very interesting look with three up top. I thought outside striker Cameron Eisenberg had a really nice match. He was dangerous throughout for the Raiders. Uh, had a good look at making it a 2-0 match uh, on a hard counter attack. Went Tried to go upper 90, but it went sailing over the bar. Eventually got that second goal to make it 2-0. Uh, Travis got a lifeline back for North with a header to make it 2-1, but then Shaker was able to add a PK late uh, for the 3-1 result and the final margin, but North worked really hard for this result. They should be proud of the afternoon of work that they put in here, and they've shown flashes throughout the year, but I, I think they really showed the area a great deal here in the last four days. Going to Mayfield on Wednesday, being down a man in the second half, but up 2-1 to one and preserving that result, that's really a credit to them. And here on, on Saturday, looking for their first district championship since 2005 and third since 1986, they worked really hard for the result. It was a 1-0 match, again, to their utmost credit for a while, and it, a tough way to go to be sure but uh, the Rangers can be proud of the effort they put in. The senior class, uh, guys like Jake and Tony, and who have uh, really helped to be the nucleus of the program here for the last couple of years. Uh, this group should be very proud of the effort that they put in on Saturday. It just wasn't meant to be, and uh, Shaker moves on, but uh, it wasn't a lack of effort from the Rangers and a 3-1 to setback to Shaker on Saturday.